and try to recruit even more sh extremists? What? This, what? What is this guy saying? He's crazy. This guy is crazy. Hey, what is up, guys? It is a brand new day today out here in New York City. Guys, Sophia and I have been driving around all over the state, man, today because we have a few appointments and we've been working on a secret, a big Big secret. Shh, you're not supposed to say anything. I'm not saying nothing. What are you talking about? It's a secret. I know, I know, I know, I know. It's a big secret, but I have such a big mouth and I feel like I'm gonna you leak really it. You do, you really, really do. I've never met anybody with a bigger mouth than you. But yo, yeah, I'm telling y'all, man, the future is very bright for us right now, man. It's very, very bright, but we in work mode. We're gonna have a fun little vlog today, so make sure you guys smash the like button, subscribe for daily videos, and let's get this day started. Sophia kind of dressed me up today because I gotta dress, because I gotta dress appropriately. <laughs> What's so funny? It's not my fault. You have like, you have no good pants. These are the only ones somewhat not bad. It's not my fault your clothes are trash. And I didn't mean to match you with I need, I, I, need, I, I really need to go crazy shopping, all right? Cause, Same. Cause right now, Sophia and I are also matching too. Is that why you're dressing up like this? No, I did. I honestly didn't mean to do that. Wow. But it's like the same exact blue, that's hilarious. Looking at some places to get for our cats right now, man. I wanna get them like a cute little house. Guys, it's literally the earliest I woke up in such a long time for these appointments. And in between appointments, we're out here at a pet store trying to buy stuff for our cats. We have a few more appointments later on in the day, but we'll see how it goes, man. Hope for the best. Big secrets. Big secrets. Shh. Shh. Stop it. Crazy. Word. How's my hair? Is it good? My hair is crazy. All right, how much you spend on this hair? Oh my god, shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> Yo, you want to tell everybody how much you spent? <laughs> no. You don't want to know, guys. In total, actually, you don't even know how much I really spent on the, my hair. How much you spend on your hair? Probably with the with the appointment, with the um, with the tip, and with all the hair products I bought, probably like six hundred dollars or something. <laughs> So you telling me right now you spent about six hundred dollars on your hair? Yeah. Oh my god. Do, you know? Oh my god, it looks fire though. I like it. It's Sophia's new hairstyle. From brunette to blonde is very very difficult. Yo, so. her video. She's made a whole video about the whole process, so you guys should check it out because she has to make that money back <laughs> after spending six hundred dollars. Bro, come on, you need to get that. Video. All right, guys. So right now I am taking Adam to my favorite. Butter chicken spot. Sophia and I come here all the time. How many times do I take you a week to get butter chicken, So <laughs> I caught you with your mouth full. <laughs> but she's getting used to day seafood right now. This butter chicken spot is amazing, dude. It's literally the best butter chicken you'll ever have in your life, besides like having it in India. Yo, Slim, I swear to God, you said that Yemeni food, you like Yemeni food better than Daisy food. I remember. I know, I know, but Yemeni food is something different. I know, but I'm getting used to butter chicken, bro. Yo, yo you gotta try it. Happened, bro. You have Please, Adam, you, you gotta try it, bro. The butter chicken sauce. Let me know what you think, cuz. I'll try right now. Butter chicken. Well, honestly, we need to gain weight, Slim, because for our boxing matches, we need to be a little heavier. So, inshallah, Slim. We're gonna be fighting. Guys, Adam and Slim back to boxing. Real 2021, soon. inshallah. Let's what? just say. Let's just say 2021. Oh, that looks banging, right? Yo, this looks so good. Man. Oh, I, I'm telling you, it's the b greatest butter chicken spot. It's a rainy day today, y'all, man. But I'm trying to take advantage of the summer. Bismillah. Come on, bro. Don't, Adam, don't eat like that. Come on, man. What are you doing? Nothing. Why are you eating like that, man? Let me eat the buddy chicken. Just, and just go in. Honestly. Yo, he's doing wild out now. He's doing wild out. <laughs> It's banging, right? Slamming! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yo, whose man is this? Yo, so. Yo, yo, what's going on? Slamming. No one's hot. Let's get it, right? No, really good. Well, I'm really. telling you, he's not, he's, not, he's not gassing it up. No, honestly, honestly, I'm really telling good. you, is that. Slamming! Try your bite. Try your bite, son. Every time I get a bite, it makes me go a little crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Is this that good? What do you mean, crazy? Oh, bro, bro. Yo. Slim, oh my god. Yo, Slim. Hey, yo, what is this dude this this in my Hey, hey. I don't want to keep yeah. laughing. Keep laughing at me. Yo. Why are you, why are you laughing? Yo, honestly, Slim. <laughs> bro, like, why is your. Is this my jeans? Just look at, look at the ankles. Bro, are, 
Are you in a message right now? Are you making wudu? <laughs> it looks like he's making wudu, bro. Why like, is this man laughing at me? Bro, all right, so first of all, okay, Sophia has been dressing me lately. She's been buying my clothes. So she me. made you, but look at the, Slim. What's wrong with it though? <laughs> so why are you laughing? You know what I bought this for me. Bro. She bought my outfit for me. And the she's only, laughing. She the only laughing. time I wear my, my jeans like this is when I'm in the masjid making wudu and I need to wash my legs. <laughs> <laughs> I put it up like this. Damn, them ankles though. Hey, Ooh. look at them ankles. Oh, yeah, stop, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> Someone's <laughs> getting shy. You <laughs> can't lie. He's no, awesome. It's a, it's I a like, trend. It looks cool, I like the way it's it feels and I, I like that. It looks cool. For real? Yeah, I like it. So should, nice. I, should I continue letting Sophia dress me or should I fire her? Let me I mean, know. If it goes it looks high, better than the skinny jeans. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah, no, it better. Skinny jeans are not going up. But if this is higher, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. this is the high, king so of skinny yo, jeans. What is this? <laughs> this, guy's turning, this guy turned into Adam Dawa at, uh, all of a sudden. Oh, he spoke, he spoke to Ali Dawa and Dawa Man. Now he's Adam Dawa. <laughs> oh, you already know Adam Dawa, bro. <laughs> Behind the scenes. Look at the camera. Look at the camera. Make it look like you're really smiling. Make it look like you're really Behind smiling. the scenes of his photo shoots. <laughs> you don't have to make those sounds. It's not necessary. Stop judging me. I'm just having a good picture for Instagram, right? Why, 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 who are you laughing at? Why, who are you laughing at? I want a cute picture, right? I'm off, caught off guard. I'm saying caught off guard on Instagram, right? I'm caught off guard on Instagram. Yeah, yeah, tell it to the judge. <laughs> oh, look at the two lovebirds. So cute. Yo, honestly, Adam takes some good Instagram pictures. I ain't gonna lie. So, Fiero. So, what you know? Oh, shut the Ow! 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 You're annoying me today. What? I'm just saying, like, when somebody takes a picture of me, she, she'll sold the whole sky except me. Like, yeah, because the sky is prettier than yeah. your face. That's why. Oh! This is Sophia taking a picture of Instagram. Ready, Soph? Get ready to pose. This is Sophia taking a picture of me on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey. Sophia style, ready? Why is that background though? Bro, 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 go a little lower. What you doing, bro? Yo, so this is Sophia. That's all, bro. <laughs> Adam's about to show me how to do a cartwheel. All right, I've never done it. Yeah. I don't know how to do a cartwheel. I don't, I don't know how to do a cartwheel. Okay, I just never done one before. Yeah, okay. You know how to do it, bro? Bro, a cartwheel? Yeah. <laughs> I think you're just too tall for a cartwheel. Bro. Too tall, bro. Might kick the clouds in the sky. <laughs> go for the grand cut. Ready? Oh, with the building in the background. Okay. Oh, all right. It's harder than it looks, Allah. I still better is, what I was it, is, it looks way harder. It is definitely harder than it looks, Wallah. All right, guys, this has gone too far. I was not going to even step into this, but after what I've seen on Twitter today, I'm a little bit upset. So, the other day, Adam made a reaction video to an ex-Muslim. And in this video, this ex-Muslim calls out Adam... And he wanted to exchange thoughts as an ex-Muslim on Socially Profiled, our podcast. At first, I thought it was an interesting idea. You know, I thought it would be cool if we get, you know, Ali Dawa in, in it with us. Because he called out Ali Dawa in the video. But we thought about it. And we're like, you know, we don't want to give this kind of guy attention. Because he's going to try to, like, point out the bad and manipulate people into thinking his ways. And I don't want this guy to influence any of our viewers, so we're kind of rejecting that now. Ali Dawa thought of a better offer instead. He said he'll fly out this apostate prophet guy to London and we all go meet him at Speaker's Corner and we discuss our thoughts there in person. I thought this is a way better idea than a podcast because if we did a podcast, it would be digitally. So meeting in person in London in Speaker's Corner, I think would be interesting, you know, to exchange thoughts with an ex-Muslim. Imagine. Me, Ali Dawa, Adam, Muhammad Hijab, all of us team together at Speaker's Corner. That'll be, that'll be like amazing. It's like the Islamic Power Rangers. <laughs> Why did I say that? This guy is rejecting that offer. Instead, he cuts a little clip from Ali Dawa's reaction video and he posts it on Twitter, making it seem like he's an extremist. And he's also reporting Ali Dawa to the authorities. Saying that he's an extremist, he's a terrorist, tweeting the mayor of London. Like, I don't understand, like, this guy is going all out. Muslim street preacher in London says apostates are little weaklings and shouldn't be executed. That this is our religion. Dear YouTube and Metro Police UK, is this okay? Would it be okay for someone to say Muslims should be executed? He's tagging the mayor of London. Dear mayor of London, is it okay that people like this vile man can freely preach in the, your streets and parks and try to recruit even more sh extremists? What? Listen, what, what is this guy saying? He's crazy. This guy is crazy. I, I don't, I'm generally confused. He's calling Ali Dawa an extremist. This tweet 
it's kind of going big in an ex-Muslim community, and it's making Ali Dalla look bad. Here's a clip that's kind of taken out of context. This is a part of our religion. There's a reason to it. Yeah, there's a reason why there's a capital punishment because people like you, little weaklings who leave their religion and cause uh, corruption in the land by spreading it, the capital punishment in Islamic law would be applied to you. We have no doubt and we're proud of that. Yeah, capital punishment will be applied in an Islamic state. Yeah, not individuals going and doing it themselves, not individuals going and doing it themselves, not individuals going and doing it themselves like uh, idiots. Yeah, no. Under an emir, it is done, yes. And we, you know what, we'll be watching. We'll be watching. Because if you're going to cause corruption in the land, that's going to cause more uh, damage to the society as a whole. Because the Sharia didn't come to protect an individual's right. Hey, can I drink alcohol? Yeah, sure. Drink alcohol, uh, run someone over, kill them, set the, uh, uh, all this kind of chaos. No, Islam says the right of the community is greater than you individual wanting your right to freedom, which is BS. Absolutely BS, yeah? Don't get me started. So it just backfired on you. He was talking about capital punishment in an Islamic state. What he's saying is a fact. He's not saying in the UK. The UK is not an Islamic state. Or the US, that's not an Islamic state. When you act upon that, I really don't understand this man. He's really just trying to spread corruption among Muslims. I understand if you don't believe in the religion, like you don't have to believe in it. Like it's fine. Like if you don't believe. But the fact that you, like you're known to be an ex-Muslim. It shows that you still have this obsession with Islam. If you're an ex-Muslim, leave it in the past. You don't gotta leave it in your bio, ex-Muslim, and just talk about it all day and bash your religion. Facts! Like, seriously, I don't understand why he does that. Because they have Islam living right free in the head. Exactly, that's, that's what it is. These ex-Muslims just come and attack Islam. And it's crazy that they, when they see Muslim brothers unite, it bothers them. They hate it. They hate it. No one likes to see Muslims unite so like that's why we always got to stay strong together because together we're always strong and that's why we have to support each other all the time everything about this dude I find so weird even the way he talks he sounds like Siri <laughs> this guy's a fraud Ridvan Ed Edmir I don't know what your name is this guy should be reported for making these claims be a man and accept the offer come to speakers corner we'll speak it out if you really want to exchange thoughts with us as you said all right uh, yo to my fellow Muslims man yo Beware of these kind of people like they're always so revengeful and hateful and you got to stay away from this kind of stuff man And always know the truth. Anyways guys, I'm gonna end this video here We got a special podcast episode coming this Tuesday So make sure to stay tuned subscribe to social profile YouTube channel. We upload almost daily on that channel So appreciate you guys see you tomorrow with another day's vlog and solidification is action